Welcome back, fellow coders. And in this particular lecture, we are going to learn about Core ML tools. I have seeked the information highway, high and low, and there is very limited amount of resources on how to install Core ML tools and or how to use Core ML tools. In this lecture, I am going to show you eight easy steps to install Core ML tools in creating your very first core ML model. There are so many different models out there that you can use. While there is a very limited amount on the Apple site, There's a lot of third party models that you can use. However, you cannot use them unless you have Core ML tools installed. So you see there's Cafe, Keras, Ski Kit Learn, Lib SVM, Turi, BMLC. And there's just such a large array of models that you can use. You don't have to learn Python. Um, even if you want to be a data scientist and go into machine learning that way, Apple has so many frameworks that it's unbelievable to create a neural network where you don't have to use a model. I showed you that in our first project. Um, you just have to find them and you have to use them. So in this particular project, we are going to create a model from a cafe model that identifies flowers. Well, Brian, why flowers? Are you something strange? No, I, it's just the easiest one to do, to be honest with you. So that's why I chose this particular one. In fact, Apple uses it for an example, so who am I? So we're going to go ahead and we're going to create this model in eight easy steps. Step one. Okay. Download and open the lesson files and place them on your desktop. After you place them on the desktop, make sure that they are not in the folder like you see here. Open that folder and drag them directly onto the desktop. Step two. Locate and install the Anaconda setup file that you dragged out of the folder onto your desktop. As you can see, the first one at the top there on the left. Step three, open up your terminal. You can launch that and type terminal launcher on your Mac, type in terminal, and that'll bring it up. 
okay, and type conda install python equals 2.7.13. I've given you a PDF cheat sheet for you to follow along. In fact, you're definitely going to use it in step seven so you can copy and paste the code for that step. Step number four, change the directory to desktop. And you do that with CD desktop. Step number five, initiate Python in the terminal. And you do that just by typing Python. Step number six, import Core ML tools in terminal. And you do that by typing import Core ML tools. Step number seven, copy and paste the syntax from your PDF where it says step seven into terminal and when you're done if you have successfully done it you will see something like this if your terminal is white you'll see it a different color but you'll still see the same syntax and step number eight Save the new model to your desktop using coreml underscore model dot save flowers dot ml models. And that's it. You should be able to go to your desktop and locate that model. You can use that model in your previous project just replace where it says ResNet 50 with flowers and you can identify any flower be it real or artificial so congratulations on completing this lecture as well as congratulations on completing this crash course for neural networks for Swift developers, the iOS programmer's guide to neural networks. I would like to thank you for supporting me and Rouse Tech Apps. If you have any questions, please drop me an email or put it up for discussion by way of the Udemy platform. Until next course, this is Brian Rouse. Happy coding.